are you ready to take your website to the next level? In this video, I am uncovering five mind-blowing Bloxy theme features you didn't know about. Stay tuned and watch till the end because these hidden gems will definitely transform your website and boost your online presence. You can make use any of them to optimize and customizing the Bloxy theme in WordPress with Gutenberg. I'm using the Bloxy theme Pro alongside with WooCommerce. With Bloxy Pro, you can build a custom thank you page as the confirmation page once your user has completed the purchase. They will get a personalized page like the one you are viewing, which I designed in Gutenberg Editor using green shift blocks and Bloxy theme dynamic data block. I'm offering here a coupon code for the next purchase but you can go otherwise by simply leaving them a custom message. And once the Shop Extra module of Proxy Pro has been activated, you will notice under WooCommerce tab a new entry button where you start design and configure the next page. And this is Gutenberg Editor and you can insert here any block you want. And what's cool about this is that the Bloxy sidebar you can configure the page triggers. In addition, and what I like the most, is that you can use dynamic data blocks such as dynamic data Bloxy block or use ACF plugin or similar to pull in data from the order or from the client. In addition, you can select any of your product categories or the payment used. With Bloxy Pro, you can showcase your logo in archive and single product pages so your shoppers can easily find your categorized products. And to set this up, you activate within Bloxy Theme Dashboard the Shop Extra extension. And from this Manage link, you input here your brand details, such as the name, the slug, the feature image, and your logo. It's also recommended to insert a brand description so that it will show up in product page, as you will see in a second. Afterwards, don't forget to assign your brand inside WooCommerce edit screen. Now move over to the customizer to set this functionality. So look at the WooCommerce area Select the single product, open it up, scroll down a little in order to find the product step section. Here they are, click on it and activate these three options. Bloxy has a new feature to enhance your WooCommerce store by providing a modern and intuitive way to display product filters. It keeps the filters hidden initially for a cleaner shop page. Your visitors can easily reveal the filters with a simple click, making it simple to refine product searches based on their preferences. And to implement this, you begin by going to the Customizer and Widgets, and here you choose the filter Price Widget, you drag into the widget area, and if you need to check the, the, the WordPress list view, you can check to check all filters already placed as WooCommerce filters, you are allowed to check them all. The headings can easily be changed into another label and the HTML tag as well. The controls part lets you configure the filters in the right sidebar. You can enable, disable any of the filter settings whenever your users are interacting with the filters. And for the filters by color, you can set the filter by taxonomy or attributes. And it's recommended to set as attributes for a commerce shop, so your shoppers can easily find your products. You can also insert product brands to organize your online store. By clicking here, you go to the exact spot where you can enter a new brand. I have already done so and you have the fields to have the name, the slug, the feature image, and, and the logo. 
Then you will go to Appearance and Widgets, open the list view, and here they are, select brands. So the way it works is you had a new shop filter. You can change here to product brand. Then under the shop filter controls is where you change into brand like so and you can configure in the right sidebar if you want a search box if you want to show a checkbox additional extra settings include to show the label the counter a tooltip if you want and to show the reset button within the customizer product archive you enable here filters canvas click on it now and you have access to do distinct designs this left is with the sidebar where it displays a slide out panel or instead the type 2 with this beautiful inline revealing page this one both are fully integrated with your shop page layout next you will need to define the trigger icon type underneath you have four types this is a matter of personal choice you can also define and determine where the trigger visibility will be up and you can also customize the panel columns which is to define the number of columns within the panel and you can increase by changing here or decrease it let's go with four columns and you can also determine the panel default state to be closed or opened then you define the widget area source you have two options the WooCommerce sidebar or WooCommerce filter canvas which is what I want to show you and here underneath you will place all of your desired filters which you set inside the widget area and a simple trick to change the filters canvas layout is by going to the filter canvas and disable this sidebar option the Bloxy theme pro advanced taxonomy block is a powerful feature designed to enhance the display and organization of content on your wordpress site specifically with utilizing the WordPress query loop, which means using dynamic content to display your product brands. And this can be particularly useful in a WooCommerce context to create dynamic and visually appealing product displays based on specific taxonomies, such as categories or product brands. That's exactly what I'm going to demonstrate to you now, how to create a product brand archive page with this powerful Bloxy Theme Pro block. You navigate to the page or post where you want to add the advanced taxonomy block. You had the new block. I'm using the green shift blocks, the free version. I insert the row, then inside my column, I insert now the Bloxy advanced taxonomies block. We now have two options. We can choose a, a defined pattern or to create a custom one. Let's choose this one. Let's keep this simple. And now we just need to configure the WordPress query loop. And we do this by going here to the taxonomy on the right sidebar, where you can choose from different categories or attributes. I'm going to focus on the brands. I have three brands, Ava, this and Modern. The taxonomy template consists of three columns and you can check here dynamic term image, the title and the term description. You can additionally insert additional data. So you can click add after and here Bloxy dynamic data. Immediately we get the, ter the term. We can now drag it at the tops if you prefer. In conclusion, by using the advanced taxonomy block, you can create highly customized and then engaging product displays that enhance the shopping experience on your WooCommerce site.
The last feature I want to talk about is the content block feature of Bloxy Pro. You can create dynamic reusable content tiled to enhance the shopping experience on your WooCommerce site. And this helps in effectively communicating promotions, providing personalized recommendations, and improving overall site engagement and conversion rates. To create a new content block, you give a content block a descriptive title, you set the conditions for where and when the content block should be displayed, and for WooCommerce you might set conditions like product pages, cart page, checkout or a customer account a page, and then you choose where the content block should show up. And then finally you add the content to use the block editor to add and style the content you want and this could include images, buttons, short codes or any other block elements. Additionally, you can use dynamic data to insert dynamic WooCommerce content such as product information, user data or custom fields. And so by utilizing the content block feature you can create dynamic and reusable content there to enhance the shopping experience on your WooCommerce site. And this helps in effectively communicating promotions, providing personalized recommendations, and improving overall site engagement and conversion rates. And that's all for now. This list is not really complete. Meanwhile, what are your favorite Bloxy theme features? Please share them with the rest of your community in the description box. And you will love this next video you are being on the screen to learn how to sell digital products using Bloxy theme and WooCommerce. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to get more videos like this. And if you like it, please hit the like button. It helps me a lot.